Upgrading your headlights can make all the difference in safety and style. Today, I'm swapping out my stock lights for the new Hogwarts Sabretooth LED headlights, installing them on my 2021 Road Glide. I'll show you the install, I'll hit the road, and then I'll see if they're as bright and bold as Hogwarts claims them to be. Let's go. The best part about this mod is that it is plug and play. So they provide you with everything you need to get this installed on your Road Glide, including the harness, the hardware, and the mounting bracket. So first things first, we have to remove these stock headlights. So it was just a few easy bolts to access to get those off. So I did end up removing this piece here just so that I could get more space to work. And with the pull of a plug, the stock light is out. So next up is installing the mounting bracket that came with the lights. And to do that, I used a bolt, a lock washer, and a washer that came from Hogwarts. So I just repeated that process four different times for four different mounting points. And then, of course, you wanna wrench everything down and make sure it's good and tight. And now for the grand finale, the installation of the LED Sabretooth headlights. And this was super simple. All I had to do was move the wires into the right place, make sure they were out of the way, plug in both of the lights, and then mount it. That's it. Testing the lights, of course, to make sure everything is working as they should, but if they weren't, they are backed by a Hogwarts lifetime guarantee. So if you ever get these lights and you have an issue, contact Hogwarts, they will work with you. Great customer service over there. Oh, and don't let me forget, I did have to install the standoff parts. And what this piece does is it just stabilizes the vent next to the light so that it doesn't sway in the wind or fall off, which would be worse. So right here, I'm just putting the light in place and lining up the mounting points. There are four bolts that I had to put in to get this locked in place. And those are the four stock bolts, the silver ones that I took out at the beginning. And the final step for me was putting the bolts into the standoffs through the vent to hold those in place. And 
And now for a before and after and a road test comparing the two lights. And let me tell you, it is night and day, quite literally. I compared the high beams on the stock light to the low beam on the Hogwarts LED headlight. And it is literally crazy. <laughs> how much brighter this light is. Not only does it brighten up the road, but it also brightens up the peripheral. So you can see like not only the pavement, but you can see the trees around you and what's in the trees. And you can see the thoughts of the people that you're passing on the road. They're bright, they're bright. So after a 2,600 mile road trip testing out these lights, I can say I highly recommend. Much brighter and I feel much safer riding at night with these lights. So shout out to Hogworks for sending these over and allowing me to test them out. Y'all go get these Sabertooth LED headlights and if you don't like the white and the amber, they do have two white and they do have two amber. Either way, much brighter on the road. Y'all be safe out there and until next time for the next ride, bye y'all.